in today's video i just want to get ready and have a little chit chat because i haven't exactly been feeling myself and hopefully when i get all put together i will start feeling myself again because this week alone has been so tough even up to saturday which was yesterday today is sunday by the way i'm basically doing like a sunday reset because y'all i don't know what's happening lately but it's a lot if you are new to my channel hi welcome my name is beatrice and i love to post content i post travel content fashion content every day with me so if you like any of that make sure you hit the subscribe button to see more of me if you are returning to my channel hi guys welcome back thank you for tuning into another video and let's just get into it i'm gonna be fixing up my eyebrows because they grew out a little bit i don't know if you could tell so i I actually pluck my eyebrows. You no, know, I clean them up a bit because they naturally have this shape that I do like. I feel like work is gonna be coming a lot nowadays. Like it's taking a lot out of me. I now have to take public transportation back home, so it's like really, really hard. And when I get home, I'm exhausted. I don't want to do anything after that, so it's like it kind of sucks. You know, it's taking a lot of time out of my day. The problem that people don't understand is when you're at work, you're working full time, that's eight hours a day. Depending on where the job is, if you don't find a job close to your house, my traveling time is like an hour and 30 minutes. That's basically three hours of travel time to go and to come back. Thankfully, I haven't been having to travel like over there from the beginning because I work at eight o'clock. If I had to get up before six o'clock, I'll actually fucking like kill myself. No, I'm kidding. Criminal offensive side. It's crazy because like when i was in high school we also had to be there at eight o'clock and the travel time was somewhere around like an hour i never made it to first period y'all like i don't even know how i passed i probably made it to first period about like 10 times the whole entire school year i was really on the verge of failing thankfully i had a good considerate teacher that allowed me to make up for a lot of the work that i was missing because in college they do not play that like if you're missing two days trust you're failing the class and they will not give you any makeup time that's the crazy part about it what a transition it was from high school to college but anyway that wasn't the point the point was getting up early it's like really hard for me getting up early and getting on transportation that early in the morning like it's sick it's sickening and honestly work is getting so ghetto it's not even funny i've been working since i was 16. i'm now 22. Now that I think about it, I was working for six years. That's fucking crazy. Life has a funny way of showing you that you're here for a good time and not a long time. It will be okay. I know it will. I'm just like venting. If you feel me, you feel me. And that's a period. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and finish this up because I feel like I'm just talking. Okay, so I cleaned up this eye a little bit. I'm gonna brush it up just a bit so that we can trim. It was at this moment that she knew she fucked up i think i fucked that up definitely did fuck that up i think i did it at an angle oh my god i fucked them up y'all that never happened to me literally oh my god that has never happened to me you know what's funny i was just thinking about how they usually tell you like to not tweeze because when you tweeze the hairs don't grow back i would hope that's not the case for this one but that's a lie though because my hair always grows back it might take a little bit longer to grow back but it usually always grows back of course, me recording just shows that I fucked it up. Anyways, it's okay. It is what it is. The left side, I don't know why, but it always grows out a lot more than the right side. Like, there's always more hair. Don't worry about the brows, okay? I'll fix it with makeup. No problem. Like, I'll fix that. No problem. I'll just line them. I line them perfect. And they would come out a hey, okay. What gave you the confidence? um delusion i love being able to do things for myself like doing my eyebrows doing my nails doing my hair and my own lashes but trust me when i say that it does take time like it takes so much time out of my day like i'd rather just get it done like at the end of the day i work for time and i'm wasting time you know what i mean so might as well just pay for it i'm officially done with the brows so let's put on some primer i use the luminous putty primer i'm down to the pan as you can see it has really held me down for the longest time and this wasn't actually the one i was supposed to buy this was a different one i ended up liking it anyway it gives me a luminous look which i do like because it makes me look all glowy i feel like every time i record this an ambulance back there like it's ridiculous oh ah, the ghetto the ghetto the ghetto what I usually use for 
foundation is the intense skin tint by morphe 2. you know what i actually have the shein concealer that i wanted to try we're gonna try that today i'm gonna use sand and a little contour i'm gonna use golden sun you know the saying april shower brings may flowers it's may and um, it's still raining like a lot a lot I wanted to get a different foundation though because I already bought this foundation so I've been using it for the past like two years. I feel like it's time to elevate my makeup game and I'm only getting better I feel like with makeup and I'm using it more and more often. I just feel like I want to change it up a little bit. I feel like it's time to find something new. I actually had my Sephora cart have something to try but I am currently waiting to see if I can get some kind of discount because you grew cheese. How could you Mr. Krabs? You promised these children Krabby the Clown but all I saw out there was GB the Jeepscape! I do not want to be spending so much money on a foundation or anything like that even though I know I should because the more money that you spend the higher quality you get i just want to see like i'm gonna see if i'm being delusional or not let's see i wanted to try it because i heard it's like really good oh girl this is yellow <laughs> the color name is sand and i can't think of a better color name because it's actually sand like it looks like sand let me tell y'all like i tried so hard when i was like learning first learning how to do makeup i was gonna make um, first time putting on makeup video it never came out because i was just so insecure about it i'm not perfect now i'm not gonna lie to you but i'm a lot better than i was before using this for my brows i do have to do a little bit of work on this one because this is the one i cut every time i go to record something that always happens but we're gonna keep going with the flow hopefully the makeup does not look that bad we're gonna move on to contour i hope this doesn't make me look dull this color is very dull let's use a brush that's my cat donny 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 i'm gonna go get him just wanted to finish my contour i actually like this a lot this is my go-to blush the morphe 2 roll-on stick you know i don't even know if these brushes are washed i hope they are like i hope i hope i hope that they are washed because i just put them straight on my face straight on my face oh i said i was gonna get them this is the cat in question it's okay you just wanted to explore right that's what you wanted to do his name is donnie he's a pretty boy he's a pretty boy he's so cute right I know. We're going in with concealer again. Excuse me. Excuse me. Ex it get a little nice on. People do not know how to act. Like for real, for real. I also use the same liner as the eyebrow for my lips. Y'all see how he's not crying anymore? He just needed to be picked up. That's it. He just wants attention. Just because it's a heavy makeup look, I feel like it does need lashes. So I'm gonna go ahead and put lashes. The Morphe Two lip gloss. This is what I usually use on my lips. That's another ambulance, by the way. That's not the same ambulance. That's another one. People are in trouble today. Where is Spider-Man? When you need him. Where's he at? Like, he's not here. He's not here in New York today. I have not ever done the lashes last, so we're gonna see how that comes out. I had to put something on, y'all. I was getting a little bummed out, and I'm only with at the first lash. But I can already tell this makeup look is fabulous because just with one lash, look at how I look. Like, come on. You could see it. I know you could see it. Watch. When I put on the full lash, you're gonna be like, wow like wow Beatrice wow that's amazing what you can do like it's amazing what you can turn the monstrosity into like it's so fucking crazy see that you see that like the change of lashes are insane like look at first of all see that see the difference look at the difference look at that difference are you crazy anyways let me get to the other one okay 
I am finished with my makeup. I do like how it came out. I feel like it is IG baddie. And I'm gonna do my hair now. I feel like I do wanna put it up just because I don't wanna curl it. I don't wanna put any heat in it. So I feel like if I just put it up, I can part it. I don't know what's happening to my middle part. Anyways, whatever. Let's see. This is my go-to hairstyle, by the way. I don't know too many hairstyles. Okay, it's in a little ponytail now. I'm gonna grab a clip. Here's the clip I'm using. And now we have like a cute little ponytail. Gonna go get some earrings. I'll be right back. Okay, so I picked these two out. How they look like on. Because whoever made up the rules of you not being able to wear golds because it doesn't look right on you made a big mistake, I fear. Sometimes like an outfit really needs like a gold piece or sometimes, you know, it really needs a silver piece. And you're not gonna, you're not about to tell me that I can't wear a specific jewelry because it doesn't look good on me. Like what? You're bugging. This is how... I put it together okay so this is the fit this sweater is from my last video actually i did decide to keep it and i feel like it was a good choice because this outfit is pretty cute i paired it with like a little tennis skirt and it does have the shorts underneath it's the outfit for today i feel like it's a nice spring outfit actually it looks pretty cute and i feel like it goes with my hair it is okay to feel like uh not the best sometimes like it does happen to everyone i feel that even like getting yourself together you know doing your makeup doing your nails eyelashes eyebrows something like that like self-care all of that does help so if you're ever feeling down or anything just taking a shower washing your hair doing your self-care routine watching things that you like to watch reading a book or doing something that you love to do you can't forget to make time for that because i know that there's limited time in the day but you definitely have to make sure that you make time for the things that you really enjoy doing because otherwise you're prone to burn out and it's really hard once you're burnt out to get back into the space that you need to be that would conclude today's video i did go through it as you can see like in the video i wasn't feeling my best and i did follow through and the look came out good thank you guys so much for watching be sure to stay tuned i do have some videos coming up planned out for you guys that i also have short form content on this channel so feel free to go over and view those videos as well i want you guys to comment what would you do like what do you do do when you're feeling down Make sure to give this video a like if you like this video, if you enjoyed the message that I tried to portray throughout the video. And make sure you subscribe, that way you can see my videos coming up soon. Bye guys! Bye.